Hey guys, so uh, welcome to another episode of uh, Constellation Nakshatras, The Secrets of Horoscopes. And today we're going to be doing the constellation of Chitra. And I am out here in my garage because it is uh, raining quite heavily out there. And the living room is being painted, so I had no place, but then I had to make this video because obviously I cross mountain for you guys. So here I am. So you guys wanted to know, or new people here wanted to know, why is it that two people of the same sign think differently? Why is it that two Virgos might think differently? And that's when the constellations comes into play. Just within a one single zodiac sign, there are two and a half divisions of that one zodiac sign, which is ruled by a different planet, and they mean different things. So when your moon at your birth, comes into a certain degree in any zodiac sign it's being ruled by a certain constellation so if here's the zodiac sign here's the constellation behind it so today we're going to do the constellation known as chitra so during your birth when your moon was in 23.21 degrees of virgo all the way to 6.40 degrees of libra your sun and your moon for western lovers you're known as Chitra Nakshatra. And the symbol of Chitra Nakshatra is the jewel. That's right. It's like I'm just <coughs> coughing jewel all over the place. And the mythical deity that it represents is the architect of this universe. That's got to be pretty powerful. So let's find out. Oh, and then the planet that rules this is, the, is Mars. And we're going to discuss why this Mars is different than the Mars that is ruled by Merxira. All right, so let's discuss who these people really are. So Chitra people are very um, headstrong people, okay? Because even though we are in Virgo, which is ruled by Mercury, however, now that Mars energy comes into play. And so these guys have a very strong willpower to achieve their goals. And like the previous nakshatra we did ruled by Mars, which is known as Mrixira in Taurus and Gemini, those people are not as aggressive. They're not, they're not as, um, you know, bold, like ready to just fight. Those are like, you know, just roaming around in the forest. These people are about, you know, I'm going to charge ahead and I'm going to accomplish it. And the Mercury energy of Virgo is about, you know, doing ta task in a calculative manner. So these guys, you know, become very, becomes a very aggressive natured um, person who loves organizing things. They're about organizing things, but they're organizing things according to their wants and needs because the Mars energy is there. They, they want to get things done their way. Okay. And this is the, the Virgo sign, you know, it, it's a feminine sign. And it's more of looking within yourself. So a chitra nakshatra, the chitra literally represents the jewel. Okay, it represents a pearl or a shining jewel. So these guys, they're not like the other people. They're not like the Leos who want to wear all these fancy jewelries and, you know, be appreciated. No, these guys are about doing the work and letting their work shine. And... This is what ha happens when moon is in the energy of Virgo. But when moon comes into the energy of Libra, from 0 to 6.40 degrees Libra, then these guys become off. They become, you know, more off like for communication for other people. Because Libra is the seventh house. It's the directly opposite of the ascendant. So they love networking. They love, you know, talking to people, going out. You know, they're all about going on the red carpet and flashing their stuff so these guys become in this in this zodiac sign of libra these guys become very good interior designers very good fashion designers these guys become um very good uh i would say fashion stylists because they know how to sh how to make a person shine and so pr agents make good nakshatra of chitra and architects architects are um Good architects are made in this constellation as well because of the fact Chitra people 
wants to construct things and they want to construct things that are solid and that will stay on ground like the like mars energy mars wants to stay stand his ground and build upon that so this energy kind of has that you know um mutated personality so while in virgo they become headstrong people they become you know the the organizers of a company organizers of their own business but when it comes to libra then they become more about hey let's have fun let's you know let it's all about the the beauty of this world how to make the world shine that's the philosophy behind this nakshatra how to make other people shine how to make themselves shine like the jewel so this is what chatra is about now don't think that just because mars energy is there it's going to make them very selfish it's going to make them very egoistic now this nakshatra represents a person who will go through any length for other people and you need the mars force you need the mars energy to fight through and take themselves and other people to a new height this is why i said you know fashion designers stylists uh, architects they are people who are trying to make things better for other people an architect wants to make a home beautiful for you not for himself a stylist wants to make you look good not somebody else a fashion designer and a uh interior decorator wants to make your stuff look good not themselves so this is you know something you got to remember about this nakshatra so guys this was my analysis on chitra nakshatra i hope you enjoyed that and if you're new to my channel hey you just figured out why two virgos think alike and remember let me just clarify this libra has the energy of venus so remember you have libra and venus libra and mars and mercury and mars in this uh constellation of chitra that i just did so this is how you can see the dynamic changes so yeah if you're new to my channel subscribe above if you want to know more about astrology check out the link below check out my book there astrology at the speed of light otherwise i'll see you soon hopefully my room is painted next time i do this bye bye